Welcome back to Techpress. So today you wanted to withdraw money directly from Shopify. I'm going to be showing you the methods of how you can do this in a very easy way. The very first thing you want to do is to make sure that you are signed into Shopify. Once we are directly into Shopify, I want to focus into settings. Here into settings, focus into the option that says payments. Directly here into payments, you want to make sure that we can withdraw using uh, payment elements. So under your Shopify payments, you can click into managed. If you have Shopify payments, what you can do is to hit now into managed and choose when your funds will be transferred by your banking account. By default, the payouts are made every business day, but you can customize this. Now, if you're not using uh, Shopify payments, of, you're using, for example, the PayPal, what you can do is just to log in directly here into PayPal, choose the option that says go to settings, go into payments, and here you want to ensure that directly here into your PayPal account is now been linked. That means that here appears as connected. If I have an order here and somebody make this purchase, this money automatically is going to be sent directly here into PayPal, as well into all the payment provider that you choose. For example, if I go back into settings, I choose the option that says payments. And here I have the striped element. When somebody makes a purchase directly into my store, this money automatically goes directly into my Stripe account, less the 2% transaction fee. So you have to take that in mind when it comes to making payments directly into your account. And lastly, what you want to do is to enable manual payouts if you want to just use extra cost. If you're using custom payment methods such as the COD, for example, the cash on delivery, what would you need to Make sure that the order fulfillment has been completed. Mark the orders as a paid into the Shopify administrator tools and the track payments and the bank deposit. All of this should be element uh, added here into the object says manual payment method. You can add a manual payment method, choose a bank deposit, money order, and cash on delivery. Of course, this payment method should be localized into your banking store or uh, depending on what is the actual element that you choose to receive the money manually. But this is like a very easy way of how you can receive the money directly here into Shopify. As you can see, Shopify does not retain your money unless you're using Shopify payments. And of course, what you can do is to send your money uh, customizable depending on the business days you want to aim for. So, with that being said, guys, we shall reach the very end of the video. But don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you want to receive more great tips and tools of Shopify. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully, we can all see you next time.